Hello, everybody. This is Eric with Shen Feng. We're back uh, in uh, the Duke's uh, Seldora, Brightstone Cove, Seldora, pardon me. Dukes, we just killed Dukes for Asia boss. Um, I spent all the souls. I got some more fire arrows, or pardon me, poison arrows and poison knives and anything else interesting? I don't think so. I think we got our setup here the way we want it uh, for killing. Uh, I took off the uh, Black Knight Halberd and put back this, this get up back on. Since we're two-handed we don't need the stamina shield so I put my stamina ring on instead. We could be using the stone yeah, the stone. We can seem to we seem to stagger people a little bit anyway, but the stone one might stagger them better. I mean, we may we may put the stone one on at different times, especially if we do any PVP anymore. Oh yeah, I was trying on Agdane armor, and actually it's not that great. I mean, it's okay, and way better resistance than what we have, but it's a little bit heavier again. So, uh, and these these critical attack uh, gloves are much heavier. So even though there's a rare chance for a critical. Uh, I, I just don't think it's worth the extra weight at this point. Um, I mean, we're keeping really low here. I like being really low. And, uh, yeah, so we're, the, actually, these are much less in all categories, actually. Uh, how much, how heavy is this? Ah, it's 0.7 difference. Maybe we can leave, uh, Ag Danes on for a while. 0.7 difference in weight. Quite a bit better in, whoops, where are we here? Yeah, quite a bit better in most categories. <clears throat> well, all categories, to be honest, for, for this one, yeah. And by quite a bit in some of them, like, uh, yeah. So maybe we could put those on, leave those on. Oh, what, what's this critical one again? Yeah, it has good resistances, too, in the uh, curse, in the case of curse and petrification. However, the general protection is much lower. Um, so, and it's also much heavier. So, me for 0.7 extra, you might want to try these a while. Okay. Uh, what else did we figure out here? Uh, yeah, I don't. Uh, we only got see like, these boss. Uh, we got four boss souls now. I think we got this one. Uh, Old Iron King, Last Sinner, Rotten, and the Giant. Uh, so that's four. I think there's one more that we could get. Uh, so before we fight Vendrick again, we'll probably want to find that. Uh, we got lots of these tree seeds here. We only got one soul vessel left after that whole ridiculousness up in uh, Iron Keep there to get the Chaos Storm. But now we got it. We got it. So whatever. Uh, I wish I could find a better use for all of these. And uh, yeah, we only got one tree seed, but maybe we can find a time to use it. Same with the dried fingers, I don't know. So we got lots of skeptic spice and simpleton spice. Anyway, that's where we're at. Uh, weapons wise, yeah, there's still some things we could upgrade, but I'm liking the setup we have right now. Plus we have the Black Knight Halberd for tanking if we need. So uh, I'm here actually because we want to take a look at uh, horn effects now that we've killed a few more bosses and see what she has to offer us. Perhaps we could use uh, her free gift now, but there's more to choose from. Okay. Uh, so we trade. Doesn't look like she's got anything new really much, does she? Oh yes, yeah, she does. Spider Fang or Spider Silk. S for 20 decks. And Spider Fang. Can't get both. Uh, what's the description on these here? Curved Sword. Coated with a sticky, sticky silk. Slowing enemy movement. on the strong attack. That sounds cool. Oh, this is shield pe piercing now again. Uh, 
So that's interesting. Um, well, that makes a case for <laughs> for putting a bonfire acetic down in this area. That's for sure. I mean, if you can get the, uh, I don't know which one it would be though, uh, because we could get uh, Ben uh, Benhard. What's it? Jugo of Benhard, or Benhard of Jugo? Pardon me. Benhard of Jugo. We could get him to do the boss fight again, and we could kill that uh, those guys in the church uh, with him helping and continue his story with a bonfire acetic probably back at uh, the original bonfire location or we could try to find the bonfire location for a new boss of uh, Frasia and get uh, both boss soul weapons but for now let's just make a decision be nice to try them both out but that's not going to happen so I'm thinking the shieldless has got to be the winner and it would be really cool to see this in action see if it actually works I mean, I already got one weapon that pierces. It's not, it's not S for 20, it's not S for dexterity though. And I, who knows what they both upgrade with, they probably... This is only half a pound though, jeez. Um, well, that, that's nothing that, it's not very heavy either at 2. Um, damage wise, not much difference. A little bit more damage here. That S, that S rating though, once we, once we, yeah, we got lots of decks, so, I don't know. I'm thinking, uh, having two, well, that's a strong attack again though, so we have to get the strong attack. Maybe Dark Drift can do that for us, um, I don't know. A lost sinner sword too. Yeah, I don't know which one which one upgrades. We probably both upgrade with twinkling or dragon bone or something. But uh, slash and thrust. Thrust is uh, the Leo ring. Oh yeah, the Leo ring. We should put that back on now. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm kind of going for a Leo Ring build, and this would be really cool, I think, for PvP and stuff. I don't know. If, I don't. I've never seen it. I've never seen anybody use it. And if it really does slow people down, that'd be kind of cool, actually. Oh boy, that's a real tough choice. Um, maybe we'll have to use a bonfire a sea dick or something. Um, hmm. Well, uh, we can get one for free here, so... Dragon Slayer Spear would be worth picking up probably too. Okay. And she never changes to anything else, does she? No. Yeah, I don't know enough about these, I guess. Uh, I'm going to save off my decision right now uh, and do some research on those weapons, guys. Sorry for wasting your time here. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I got to do some more research uh, before I choose one there. And uh, it's okay. We're, we're going to press forward here and get into a new area today. So that's, 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 that's great. Um, but I hate these guys, so I'm going to kill them. Ah, that wasn't, I wasn't ready for that. What happened there? Died just for attacking me. I shouldn't be killing all these people with no uh, item discovery on them. Spiders, I mean. Um. Okay, well... Boot it. Let's 
So we got the king's ring. I guess I should put it on if we're gonna go through a new area. But I think I thought I was thinking that the newest area that we haven't gone through that would be interesting would be the shaded woods one. Um, where is it? And there's this crossroads here, right? We've tried the king's door in in uh, Forest of Fallen Giants, and we got Twinkling Tight Knight, but there's obviously a tree there that's going to have to be done, you know, in some different order because there's nothing that we can else we can do there. Um, there's one in Drang Lake Castle, I know, but uh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking this is the way to go. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, there's a king's door down this way, I believe. Is there not? Get that ring on now. Take the thorns off. It's working. And we have a new area. Aldia's Keep. Now this is uh, where they keep talking about Lucatiel's uh, Lucatiel's uh, adventure ending. Hmm. Well, it's closing. Well, I got in the doors. So let's get that off. Got for enemies over there. Obviously, I should get my bow on again too. Oh, it's still on. Oh, it looks like rats. I hate the rat dogs. Just fi finished fighting them in the Rat Authority boss room, and I don't like them. But I know they drop good things, maybe. So maybe I should. Uh, we got into a new area here. Maybe, oh yeah, we just blew it all on this uh, this get up. We might as well use use get up, right? Um, item discovery. So this is the best one. I can't remember. Yeah, I think it is. And then uh, prisoners. I guess the gloves can stay on. The gloves don't matter. I don't think. I got those leggings. Okay. These are dark arrows. I've got, got cocked here. One hit. Well, oh, they're all coming now. You well, know, maybe I should put my sword back on here. Dropping much, are they? Is that a drop? No, that's just a pickup. Poison throwing knife. Throwing skull, that looks like a bonfire. And there's Lucatiel. 
Now, did we finish everything? I think we did. So maybe she's ready to give us her, her stuff. Who are you? Oh, no. No, forgive me. It's really sad shape I here. Know you. Yes, of course. Is that her mask or not? I don't think that's her mask. She's turning hollow, though. How goes your journey? I know not what you seek in this... But I pray for you. Please take these. Oh, thank you. Consider this thanks for keeping me safe. My name is Lucatil. I beg of you, remember my name. For I may not myself. My That's name is Lucatil. Sad. sad. I beg of you, remember my name. For I may not myself. My name is well, Lucatil. Read that message. I beg of you remember, for I may not. Yeah, that's pretty sad. Now, I don't know. Uh, her, I know I think her sword is like a uh, strength weapon, right? So, whatever. Well, we didn't have to. I guess we didn't have to put it on, but. Well, that's twenty a dex. We could, we could, we could one hand, we could one hand it even. Uh, I don't know what it upgrades with, but it's supposed to be a great sword. Uh, so like a claymore. Seven pounds, not too bad. I'll have to see what it upgrades with, I guess. But uh, no, I'll keep the dirt drift on for now. All right, what are we doing here? Fire seed, nice. Almost just, just upgrade that immediately. Our regular glove is falling behind the well behind the other one there, so. Secret walls, anything? go. Oh, enemy ahead. Try attacking. How do we... How can we tell? Does it look like... Is it really a mimic? Sunset Staff. Uh, dark Mask. Well, cool. I think I already got the Sunset Staff for uh, the other guy. Dark Mask. Try that out. Oh, cool. <laughs> a little bit more uh, resistance, but it probably doesn't have any item discovery, does it? Manipulate dark. Uh. Well, I'm glad I took a second look, because I would have missed it. Otherwise, um, but I think that's curbing out the uh, things to do here in the fore garden.
Yeah, it's right jumping off, I bet you. Jim, is that holy water here? Probably not. Left and then item? Okay. I don't see any item over here. There we go. Twilight herbs. I always use more of those. The message is dark spirit. Alistiel Amura. So that's Lucatiel's dad or something like that? Who's this? Oh. Oh, our battery controller's low. Not good. Oh boy, come on. Fighting him with all this item discovery crap on. Well, I guess he could drop better then. The Dark Drift works on his shield turtling too. Get some stamina. No drop. Oh well. Somebody's in that carriage, seems like. here. Oh, a big dragon. Bones. Uh, I just re recognize that I don't have my item find ring on. If you got all the other item find stuff, you might as well put the ring on as well. I don't know how to get these open. Oh, well I could see why these hide behind this thing, maybe. This isn't really a boss room, is it? Oh, I guess it is. Oh, wow. Something inside of the... Oh. Something inside there died, I guess. Stone drop. I petrified something there. I don't like those mirrors. Creepy. Yeah, no. 
Big frog again, big salamander, or whatever that you want to call that. Not salamander. I guess they're like uh, big frogs. that. It's curse, is it? I don't need to lock on. die here. Forgot how there's a reason why I kind of avoided this guy in the first place. I hit the candelabra. Oh! Kept him kind of close here. Oh, and not so. Wow. That's really nuts. And water here. Magic stone, dragon sage hood. Sounds pretty cool. Whoops. What could you. Oh, yeah, my controller's low. I forgot. I forgot. I'm gonna have to change that right now before I forget. Be uh, right back here. My backup controller ready to go here, which I don't like as much as my main one, but whatever. It's a little tight because it's new, but I'll break it in, I guess. Okay, whoops. That's all we need to do? Sure. Okay. Oh, yeah, the dark, uh, dark thing. Not, no, not dark. Uh, there's, well, there's Luca Teal's mask. Um, what did we just pick up here? The dragon helm or something. Dragon sage hood. Huh, looks alright. It's actually kind of light. I've seen other people wear it in PvP. Might have some special effect or something. Whoops, well that's what I should have checked out. You want to check it out, check out the special special effects. Uh, Archmaster Valdia. Curse works. Course of their work. Nebulous face of the mask is designed to deflect the ire of ritual sacrifice. I don't know what it gives, if anything. Not overtly obvious. Okay. So what's this way? Chest. Yeah, the only thing on this new controller that really sucked is the left uh, D pad. I really got a two more of these. We got lots of these now. Yeah, 
chance. It just didn't work. I tried to put on my weapon again. I guess it's just a new controller, pretty tight. Maybe I'll just have to press a little harder. And here we go. Here's something. We can't use it. Who dat? Oh. Oh, there's a door there, which is nice. But, uh, I don't. Oh. We're not really done with the previous area, are we? Uh, recall getting everything in here yet, so we came up that way. Oh, we could uh, release this guy, I guess. I don't know why we'd want to, but we should probably do it so we can get a drop perhaps. time remembering how to fight these guys here with this, con this controller isn't helping either. Oh boy, I don't want to get mauled to death here. Oh, that was dumb of me. That was really dumb, Eric. No protection ring on either, so I'm not even human anymore. That was really stupid. That I, I can't, I, you know, I, I can't. Sometimes I baffle myself on how stupid I can be. That you know, I'm I'm, fig I'm almost to the end of the game here. And this isn't. This is the very first creature we're gonna find in the game, and I remember killing him the first try. You know, with the knife, or something like that. And I and I just totally sucked there. Had him down to nothing. Only had one hit yet left. Could have healed. I gotta erase the memory of this this fight, guys. I don't care if it costs an effigy. I'm, er I'm erasing the uh, I'm erasing the memory of that fight. And I'm putting on the bloody ring. <laughs> I don't care if my stamina recovery or my equipment load isn't as good. Uh, I guess that was an opportunity to get the better pyro, but for the boss or something. But I'm erasing the memory of that fight. That's all there is to it. And I don't know. Maybe we should get this. See what's inside here. I guess we can't. That's really interesting. Dragon killed us. So we didn't do everything here yet. Oh, jeez. What are you doing? We didn't look down here yet, anyway, I guess, so. All kinds of messages. Jeez. Pull back. Pull back. Pull back. Oh, I think I've read some, uh, or heard, or at least heard of spoilery allusions to this here. So there's a choice you can make here. Either you pull the thing or you don't. So some people say it's, you know, why not pull it? Uh, many people say don't don't pull it, and it's yeah I can't remember, but which is probably better. Um, again, something I'm going to do some research on before pulling. So 
I'm not going to just pull it without knowing what it's going to do. So if it's that important that people spaz out about it, write, write uh, you know, lengthy bits on it uh, for... Please, just stay away. No, please, don't come near me. Nothing good will come of it. Just leave me alone, please. Well... Leave this place and leave me be, as I'd not see any harm befall you. Please, just leave me alone. Well, we can always come back, I, I would think, right? Please. Obviously, you pull the trigger, and it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna lift this veil, and there's gonna be some kind of big fight. I've heard people really having a hard time with the fight, and there's better rewards if you just leave them alone for now. I think so. Oh, well, now we're invaded by a real dark spirit. Um. Shouldn't really have our item discovery stuff on for this, but. Well, are you coming to fight, or are you? Well, oh, there he is. What kind of surprise can I have waiting for him here? We have Chaos Storm. Why does my heart rate always go up when there's an invader, even if it's like not even that exciting? <laughs> it's kind of boring right now, actually waiting for him to come here. But I'm gonna give him a, I'm gonna give him a chaos storm. I don't like getting invaded as much. I like duels and stuff like that. Duels and stuff are fun. Getting invaded and having my game interrupted is part of the game, and I don't mind it. But it brings out the, uh, it brings out the uh, trickster in me, and I'd rather just give him a chaos storm to start the fight here. He's invading here, and he doesn't even know the whole area, probably, I guess. He's looking around all up there. There he is. No, oh, that was a bad timing on my behalf. Lose any health at all? Dual wheel, dual wielder like me, I guess, eh? Oh, piss off with that bullshit! Piss off! Bloody uh, crossbow bullshit. Well, I keep forgetting what I'm doing here. This was a this is an invasion. I didn't. I guess it doesn't really matter what the fuck. I should have been healing healing more and no holds barred kind of kind of strategy. I just got used to doing PvP on the keep, and I did too noble, I guess. Anyway. Uh, a buff would have helped me there too, probably. I just don't. I just never think of buffing or even having a buff on my bar for situations like this. I had more than enough time to prepare, though, so that's no no excuse for that. Um, I got enough rings to offset that bullshit, though. That's good. 
Yeah, I didn't, you know, you don't really, you're not even set up for PvP when you got your bloody item finds shit on and all that kind of stuff. Really annoying, actually. Um, so he does come back. Well, I did have a couple good uh, items there to use, though. I had my poison knives and urns there. I don't know why I have those urns on, but at the moment. Uh, let's see here. What could I add to my bar right now? Maybe some lightning? Or dark? Maybe some dark. I'll try it out. And we got these uses to replenish. Everything's replenished now. Um, So we could try to farm these guys. Uh. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, I don't have my dual wielding on now. I was locked on and I took it off. Are you kidding me? They're one hit kills? And petrification? Holy Christmas. So petrified means I didn't even save myself from uh, losing my humanity and souls, I wonder. I should have put that other one on, the petrification one on, I guess. Oh, no, I saved my humanity. Uh, that, that's 3,000 souls down the tubes again here. Man. Is that all the souls I have? I thought I had more than that. I me. should have more than that after killing that big thing. Oh, yeah, and I still haven't put my Leo ring on yet. I think the item discovery is going to have to go here. Well... Yeah, I'm not, I'm not farming these guys right now anyway, so... Uh, no, I don't need the petrification one. I'm not farming these guys right now. I'll do that off-stream. Forget these... Forget these things. I'm out of here. Okay, now back to what we were doing. It's so annoying when you get an invader, one thing just spirals to the next, and you just lose your place and where you're doing, what you're doing, and... I really would have liked to finish that guy off too, he's such an idiot. Is that who's in there? I, I couldn't get open it, so whatever. Okay, so that guy's in there, we've already checked that out. Is that guy back now? Oh, this is... Oh, this guy's here, yeah. Died on this guy. Forgot. That was dumb. Again! Really dumb! Why could I... How can I fight these guys so dumb? Anyway, well, I'm just going to resign to the fact that I'm really playing dumb, and I'm just going to do this. Got a couple extra. I got a couple extra fire seeds, or whatever, or not fire seeds, but whatever the stupid... Uh, Probably would have dropped this anyway, but acolyte mask. I've got all couple, two different kinds of masks now up here. Um, uh, 
Again, it's all about the sacrifices. This one's part of it. Um, no idea what to, to think of all that yet. Maybe I'll look it up in the guide later, I guess. Um, okay, well, yeah, we should have come here anyway and checked things out. Um, maybe we can get to the next part now. Down there, we came from the other side. This guy's back now. Well, we got a drop from him last time. With all this stuff on. We got lots of. We got some pyro left. I don't know. Uh, it's in his cage, though. He broke out of the cage last time, though, so I don't know if that makes any difference. I can't dual wield with this thing on. Anyway, okay, so... What kind of herbs have we got? I guess that's it. Okay. I think that's it. There's something big at the end of there. They said to go right. Okay, well, we got enough of these that this is probably worth it. It's nice and light out. What kind of monster is that? It's in a cage. That's another one of those guys. Drop this time though. Whoa! Okay, well, that was an interesting turn of events. I thought it was just wrecking stuff. Uh, read message. Oh, try attacking. Oh, okay, well, I did. Um. Another cage back there. Okay, looks even more uh, dangerous than the last thing we were doing here.
this one. Poison. Ooh, weird shit in there. Lots of summon signs. Salamanders or some kind of dogs. Okay, looks like it's daughter's book time pretty soon here, so maybe we'll call it a session and uh, even though there's lots of interesting stuff coming up, I think we'll call it for now and I'll start her up after book time's over. Alright, bye for now.